Hello friends, this is Normal here for Technique and today we are going to compare two mid-range phones the ASUS Zenfone 2 Laser with the Xiaomi Mi 4i. So right now we have uh, these two devices which are priced uh, uh, in the budget to mid-range segment. Uh, the ASUS Zenfone 2 Laser, we have the base variant of it, uh, the Snapdragon 410 powered variant with 2GB RAM, 5.5 inch uh, HD display, it has a 30 megapixel rear camera. Uh, with a uh, dual LED flash and also 5 megapixel front facing camera. This is priced 999. Uh, there is also a variant uh, which has 3 gigabyte RAM and a Snapdragon 615 Octopus chipset. So that's the difference here. Now we have the Xiaomi Mi 4i, which is uh, uh, a beautiful device which has a 5 inch full HD display. It's powered by the Snapdragon 615 Octopus chipset uh, with uh, 2 gigabyte RAM, 16 gigabyte internal storage, a 13 megapixel rear camera. 5 megapixel front facing camera. Both these devices have a uh, batteries close to 3000 uh, milliamp amp and both are powered by Android Lollipop. Now let's get started into the detailed comparison. So first step let's see the design and build quality. So design wise the ISO Zenfone 2 Laser has the same design language as that of the Zenfone 2 uh, with the curved rear panel. You can see the power button on the top and the volume key on the rear panel. We have the uh, dual uh, LED flash, the camera and the laser autofocus. So it's a matte finish uh, but the quality of matte finish could have been better. It's not a brushed metal finish unlike the Zenfone 2. We have the speaker also located at the bottom. Then on the front panel you have the 5.5 inch HD display, the three capacity touch buttons and also the pattern at the bottom. And uh, you also have the ASUS branding on the top. So all in all this device uh, feels uh, slimmer towards the edges and uh, it feels thicker towards the center portion and uh, it does give a good feel on the device. Uh, but having said that this device is pretty heavy it's not the lightest of phablets around in this price point it's pretty heavy uh, it's not uh, that compact in nature on the other hand uh, the xiaomi mi 4i has a pretty compact design uh, it's a 5 inch device it's an optimal design it is pretty slim as well you can see the chrome finishing on the power and the volume keys uh, the camera on the rear panel the dual led flash and also the speaker located and uh, it also has a matte finish of uh, rear panel but the quality of the rear panel looks much better than the ASUS Zenfone 2 it's a really good uh, finished uh, device and uh, we can see this also has uh, the three capacity of touch buttons and uh, uh, this um, has this 5 inch uh, full HD display with the Mi logo on the top so overall in the material and build quality we would say the Xiaomi Mi 4i is slightly better here because it's pretty compact the 5 inch is uh, pretty ideal and also the design wise you can see the Mi 4i is pretty compact and uh, lightweight and also slimmer than the ISO Zenfone 2 Laser. But having said that the Zenfone 2 Laser has a bigger display so obviously it won't be really as compact as um, uh, the Mi 4i so it's a personal choice on whether you want a bigger display uh, and so you have uh, the, the device which is um, heavier than the Mi 4i which has this compact 5 inch display. Now moving on to the display, uh, both these devices have a completely different uh, in terms of the display. Uh, the Zenfone 2 Laser has a 5.5 inch HD display that's a 70 dB display. While a lot of devices compromise uh, in the sub 10k price point on display, ASUS has not compromised on the display and it looks pretty vibrant, colorful. Uh, the touch response is very good, the viewing angles are also very good. So all in all, this HD display is pretty good on this price point and uh, uh, it does work really well. Now talking about the Xiaomi Mi 4i, this has a full HD display that's uh, uh, much more resolution than uh, the HD display and it's a smaller display that means uh, pixels per inch is higher on the uh, Mi 4i and this has a sunlight uh, display. So all in all, in the display on the Xiaomi Mi 4i is uh, far more superior than what is offered on the Zenfone 2 Laser. But in no means uh, Zenfone 2 Laser is uh, inferior. It's only the difference between HD and uh, Full HD display. And uh, specifically the display on the Mi 4i is superior because it's a sunlight uh, display and the touch response is very good. Overall, uh, viewing angles are also really good. So all in all, uh, in the display aspect, the Mi 4i is a clear winner here. Now moving on to the software and performance. So here both these devices run Android uh, Lollipop uh, but they have custom UIs. Now talking about the Zenfone 2 Laser, this has this Zen UI which is uh, really powerful and you can see the he heavily skinned UI, lot of additional features and options included. So when we reviewed the Zen UI we mentioned that this is one of the 
uh, highly customizable rooms for Android and it's pretty good uh, solid performing UI lot of additional gestures supported even the camera and other apps uh, are also pretty good on this uh, UI and uh, overall uh, this is a pretty polished UI uh, feels good and also performance wise this is pretty good uh, with the Snapdragon 410 uh, quad-core chipset with 2 GB RAM and uh, the overall performance uh, was lag free no major issues the gaming experience was also pretty good we tested most of the heavy graphic rich games and uh, we didn't have much uh, issues there was no heating at all on this device even with heavy usage the, the temperature remained uh, nominal and uh, overall this phone also comes with 4 GLT support 16 GB internal storage which is expandable and you can also move apps onto the SD card so those those are the good aspects of this device so overall uh, with the Snapdragon 410 uh, quad core chipset and uh, 2 GB RAM this performs pretty well now talking about Xiaomi Mi Fi right, this runs on uh, uh, Mi UI 6 uh, which is a custom UI from the company and uh, this runs Android um, 5.0 along with that this has a uh, Snapdragon 615 Octa-Core chipset with 2GB RAM now here there is a big difference in performance although the Mi UI 6 uh, is heavily skinned UI with a lot of additional features you can see the custom notification center it's a powerful UI but the problem is the performance it's not really as performing as the uh, the Zenfone 2 laser with the Snapdragon as uh, 410 quad-core chipset uh, the 615 does not really have that optimization and uh, it lacks a lot in many of the areas where even the gaming performance was pretty decent not the best there was heating and if you use the phone continuously for almost half, half an hour to 45 minutes it gets heated up so that's a big issue uh, although Xiaomi has released uh, a lot of uh, updates the heating issue is in the really solved and if you are looking for heavy performance uh, uh, Xiaomi Mi 4i is not really recommended because it does hang uh, there is lag uh, and the gaming experience was also not that good the device also has 4 GLT support but it's restricted to 16 GB internal storage and there is no expandable storage so that's another big issue with this device so overall the software and performance uh, we would say the ASUS Zenfone 2 is a better choice uh, in terms of the software experience and also uh, the overall performance aspect now moving on to the camera now both these devices come uh, with uh, uh, a 13 megapixel rear camera you can see there is a 13 megapixel rear camera dual LED flash and additionally the Zenfone 2 laser has a laser autofocus so this is the first time a laser autofocus has been included in the uh, budget or rather the mid-range segment and this is one really good aspect uh, about this device now interface wise both these devices are really good uh, while the Zen UI offers lot of additional features and modes uh, even uh, the Mi UI also offers uh, some good amount of tools we have uh, uh, additional options included you can see that it does support uh, filters and other modes so all in all uh, both these devices uh, have pretty good camera UI while uh, feature wise the ASUS Zenfone 2 laser with uh, the Zen UI uh, the Zen camera uh, or rather the Pixel Master camera app uh, performs uh, pretty well with the laser autofocus now talking about the camera images it's it's a tough choice on whether to decide which is better camera here because both these devices does have pretty good camera performance overall uh, both these devices have great clarity uh, for this price point you can't say this is a flagship quality but this definitely has uh, pretty good clarity in this price point the colors look pretty good uh, overall the clarity of both these devices are pretty good overall the advantage for uh, Zenfone 2 laser is the laser autofocus which is uh, pretty fast in focusing that's uh, probably one issue with the Mi 4i which does not get the focus right all the time uh, so all in all in the camera aspect it's a tough choice but we would, uh, we would give it to the Zenfone 2 laser for the laser autofocus and slightly better photo clarity overall uh, in the camera aspect now both these devices have a front facing selfie camera and does perform pretty well uh, in the selfie experience now talking about the final aspect the battery life both these devices have pretty good battery life uh, both have uh, 3000 milliamp of battery capacity and the performance is also pretty good on both these devices uh, on both these devices you can get uh, more than a day of usage if you are a casual user and you can easily get a one day of usage even if you are a heavy user so the battery performance is a tie because both these devices do perform very good 
even though the Zen Fold 2 laser has uh, uh, a bigger display it's an HD display while uh, the Xiaomi Mi 4 has a smaller display but it's a full HD display so the battery performance was pretty good on both these devices now talking about the pricing aspect so that's the one area which differentiates between these two devices so Zen Fold 2 laser is available in two variants one is a 999 variant with the Snapdragon uh, 410 quad core chipset and uh, uh, 2 GB RAM that's the one we are tested right now comparing that variant with the Xiaomi Mi 4i if you're looking for great performance obviously we would suggest a Zen Phone 2 laser without uh, major issues or lags but if you're looking for a great display and compact uh, form factor then the Xiaomi Mi 4i is better now if you're looking for uh, uh, the Zen Phone 2 laser that's the 13999 variant with the Snapdragon 615 Octaco variant with 3 GB RAM uh, we are not really sure on that but does definitely has one gigabyte ram additionally and also this has expandable storage what is that is what missing on the xiaomi mi 4 i so these are the aspects uh, to consider so if you're looking for a zen phone 2 laser with advantages for zen phone 2 laser it's a pretty decent display the software and performance is pretty spot on the camera quality is pretty good the battery life is also good and it has 4g lt along with 16 gigabyte internal storage which is expandable now talking about the mi 4 i strength uh, it has some um, uh, better display the camera performance is pretty good the form factor is good uh, the build quality is again good uh, the battery performance is good but then the overall uh, software and performance was not that great and um, uh, that's one uh, that's one area where the Xiaomi Mi 4i lags behind and also Mi 4i is priced 12.9 almost 3k big, big, uh, difference between the Zen Phone 2 laser base variant and the Mi 4i base variant so all in all it's a personal choice uh, we would suggest the asus zen phone 2 laser uh, because of the better performance so that was a detailed comparison of these two devices hope you like this video don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe to your youtube channel for more videos thanks for watching have a great day